Morning guys, Wobble Box Adventures. Today we're off up to the camper and caravan show, or camping and caravan show up at the NEC. Um, so it's uh, mum, Riley, granny and me. And we're gonna take the Land Rover up and uh, go and have a look around and have a nose about. So stay with us and uh, let's see what we can find today. Uh, so we've uh, eventually arrived at the NEC. Bit of traffic whilst we were uh, travelling up, but not too bad. Um, so we just parked the car up, and we're just going to go on our way in. See you in a minute. Hi guys, so we've just arrived at uh, Zone 5, so we're just going to have a nose around now, all the tents and I think this is the main camping uh, area, so, so kayaks and bits and pieces, so we're just going to have a look around, show you about a bit. So as you can see guys, there's uh, quite a few people here, we've arrived, it's about 20 past half past 10 and uh, already it's busy, car parks are really rammed out there. But, uh, loads going on here, loads, some good prices, clothing behind me. Woods burners earlier on. So, uh, yeah, some, I think we're in the best hall for us because this is uh, hall five, as I said just a minute ago, and it's got all the camping van and stuff in here rather than the caravans and the motorhomes. So, yeah. uh, Fango got a rolling for me for the caravan, and it was good, really good with the wind and everything. 
right, we'll keep looking, we'll see you in a bit. I think we might have just found a uh, TP for Riley and his uh, friends. Blue one's going to be better for him though, I think. Really cool for the kids though, be nice for in the garden. Uh, this is my type of camper van, full on bar in the back with the barrels. Loving it. Little chair access camper van there. Caravan, I should say, with the trailer on the back. Cool. Quite a mad layout. Toilet in the back, right on the corner. Bedding is at the front. And then they've got their little kitchen pod right here. I found a, camp a caravan the same size, uh, well, a good size for Riley. As you can see, he's a uh, one to have a look. <laughs> We've unleashed the beast at the NEC. He's now having a, a walk around. We can only keep him in his pram for so long. No, but he's been in the car for two hours coming up, so time for a run around and for him to have a look at the camper vans as well. I like this idea, guys. So it can be a kitchen pod inside the vehicle. And then you can uh, unrelease it, flick it outside, and then cook it outside your van. So, uh, yeah, pretty good little uh, idea that is. A lot of people would craft those, I suppose, if you built the kitchen pod halfway out of the sliding door, and then put it on a pivot, it'd swing around. Hmm, something to think of. I don't know what you guys are thinking. Colour clash with the van, right? Guys, mini camper, what are we thinking? I might sleep in for the night at a festival or something now. Really? 
Foley. It's a short turn. So we've just come to the Airstream stand. Um, I'll put some photos in as well, but the quality of these are awesome. A lot of people saying they're very claustrophobic though, and they do look a little bit inside. There's not a great deal of room as you can see in there. whilst walking around the camper show. He did walk for a fair bit, mind you, so fair play to him. He's probably uh, shattered. So we... That's us uh, leaving the caravan motorhome show, um, camper and caravan show. So we'll uh, see you on our next adventure. Um, I'll put some photos at the end so you can have a look at the bits that you've missed. See you later.
Thank you.